another thing i'm saying if i started today's class after completion of uh, 15 days uh, you want to start installation means it's not a right process because i seen after completion of 20 days they sent me hello world program on first lwc conference really it's not good yeah i'm requesting everyone please complete on time at least two days three days on on to that time because it should be good yeah it should be good and you can easily remember all the things that is a thing yeah everyone understood my point why i'm saying this information yes, everyone sir. understood my point yes sir. yeah yes, sir. yes i can know that you have work but at least one hour time categorize on this not overall time at least one hour time Okay, so coming to the today's class, I've been going to be teach about the JavaScript. Let me try to complete the JavaScript first of all. Uh, so then after completion of the JavaScript, let me try to derive the, my first LWC component and uh, let us create an application each and everything. After completion of my agenda, then I'll go further. Okay. Yeah, is my screen is visible to everyone? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, so coming yes, to the previous sir. class. Okay, and uh, my voice is clear and any noise from my side or everything is okay. That's fine. Everything is fine, sir. Fine, yeah, from your okay. side. Okay, fine. So coming to the yesterday class, I discussed about JavaScript. So under the JavaScript, I discussed about variables. Okay, data types. Array array methods string methods one minute in one minute yeah, i'm taking water that's it that's why i told one minute it's okay okay like i discussed about string methods string interpolation and uh, what I discussed, okay, some other things I discussed in yesterday class. Coming to the today's class, there are very less concepts related to JavaScript. Let us complete that concepts and let us see further. Coming to the today's class, let us see the theoretical. This is a theoretical concepts in LWC I'll discuss. In LWC, there is some syntax which there I'll discuss. It is used to handle the asynchronous operation. Either success or failure. For example, you retrieve the data from the FX class from the back end. Okay, account records. Okay, if the records are available. Okay, just imagine if the records are available. Then I'm storing in the list. It's a success. Okay, means record are available successfully. No, there is an error. Okay, then we have dot catch. Means error will capture the data. Okay, immediately it will store the errors or whatever it will. Just in future upcoming classes, FX imperate on prompt, I'll discuss. Means this is failure. Means there is an error. Like either two phases in each and every scenario, either success or failure. I'll discuss in LWC. So promises are used to define either. We can go to success or it should be failure. Just let us discuss this. Just I give an example, but let us discuss the theoretical everything in upcoming process promises. Then, okay, query selector and query selector. Query selector is nothing but it is used to target the first tag inside the HTML. It is tar it targets the first tag. For example, if you have a uh, like uh, four p tags. If you want to apply color, okay, query selector will target only the first tag. 
okay and it targets all tags presented inside let us see this okay let us take with one example then you can able to understand okay i linked these two things now Okay, just I'm creating the new tags. Okay, I'm using class selector ABC. Hello, everyone, I mentioned. Okay, just I mentioned these uh, three new tags. I want to apply from the query selector, you will take the data which is uh, presented inside the HTML. In LWC, we'll use this dot template dot query selector. Okay, if it's a div tag, just I'm taking the data which is presented inside the div tag and I'm applying the color console.log. Just if you want to print the data in the back end, you can print. But I'm applying some color. Okay, I'm applying some red color. Okay, so here we have three div tags, but only if it's a query selector, it only targets the first due tag and it will apply the color to red you can able to see the output click on go live yes according to my requirement only on the first tag i need to highlight with uh, this particular red color what is uh, green red color because it's a query selector it's a query selector you need to use a type is equal to module i'm not sure let's see yes everyone able to see so we have three div tags only under the first div tag it is highlighted with red color everyone able to see yes sir am i audible to everyone yes sir Clearly. yes sir you are audible sir only targets the first tag i'm saying again the concept is query selector will take only the first tag okay for example if Venkat, now you are breaking out yes sir there is a breakage in your voice query selector the tag one thing that you uh Venkat, your voice is now? breaking now also so breaking Same sir, issue? Don't know why. yes yes one minute i'm not sure why now also same issue say breaking no now for me it's fine sir now also same issue okay no, fine, fine. Oh. with earphones no no fine so for me okay fine okay now is my screen visible to everyone yes sir yes sir for me it's visible okay okay fine 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 if it's a query selector means it targets only the first tag okay if it's a query selector only targets all the due tag okay if you have multiple due tags <laughs> if you have multiple due tags i'm using array to store all the elements whatever it may be just i stored all the elements i'm storing all whatever the data whatever it may be just i'm storing inside the array okay then i'm using a for uh, for each loop to iterate the data okay and i'm applying some color okay then i'm applying some color okay i'm applying the color I'm applying the color to green. Now you can able to see previously it is red. Now now all the div text it is been highlighted to green color because query selector is used to target all the elements which is presented inside the HTML. So here I'm I'm storing all the elements inside the array. Then I'm using a for each group to iterate the data and I'm been representing all the div tags with the green color. Yes, everyone able to see the output here. All the div tags is been highlighted with green color. 
because I used a query selector. Yeah. Through query selector, we are, uh, we are getting yeah, all tag. HTML elements in uh, all div tags in JavaScript, and then we will apply color, right? Thank you. Yes, that's it. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Query selector, query selector. And another thing, so which is set time out and set time interval. Okay, if it's a set time out means like after completion of the time, after completion of the time, the code will be executed. For example, if you mention 1000, after 1000 milliseconds, the code will be executed. Okay, if it's a set interval means in between the okay in between the duration. For example, if you mention 1000 milliseconds, in between the 1000 milliseconds, multiple times the code will be executed. In between the duration, multiple times, code will be executed. If it's a set interval, set time out means, but we'll use set time out only if we used in our LWC only. But we'll not use set time out. Just only for reference purpose, I told you. Set time out means after completion of the code, it will be executed. You can able to see window dot set time out. Okay, just I'm mentioning console dot log of hello. Okay, I mentioned thousand milliseconds after completion of thousand milliseconds. If you mention two uh, three thousand milliseconds. Okay, after completion of the 3000 milliseconds only, hello will be executed. Yeah, if I save it, means it will count from them onwards. That's after after executing this. If it's a set interval, okay, if it's a set interval, then like uh, in between the like in between the 3000 milliseconds, multiple multiple times the code will be executed. Okay, in between the uh, 3000 milliseconds multiple times this high will be executed here after completion of the uh, thing only that uh, this this will be executed i'm clicking on control s now we, now it will be started the count let me try to click on inspect so it may take 3000 milliseconds see after 3000 it is executed but high is executing in between three times four times we cannot estimate how much time but we'll use set time button everyone able to see it like that uh, how many times it will execute so set interval we cannot estimate we cannot estimate okay set time out only one set interval in between multiple times it will be executed okay so yeah this is the thing everyone understood about set time out and set interval don't go into deep dive just only the concept concept wise when you go to lwc then you can compare them and when you got the concept means you can easily understand the things that's why i'm discussing this anyone have any queries no sir so and another thing events events what is events okay there are two types of events okay one is a standard event and one is a custom event why we need to use standard event standard event there are some more in lwc it is on click on key up only this standard events will use i'll tell you when we need to use which condition if it's a custom event everyone please connect with your system i'll check the installation of your salesforce okay custom event whenever if you are establishing child to parent communication we'll use custom event i'll explain so now we are go now we are discussing about on click how on click means whenever if you click the button okay uh, whenever if you click the button then immediately i need to highlight then we need to use on click whenever if it's a button if it's input box means we need to use on key up on change both act as like same functionality okay both act as same functionality on click means when we are dealing with button in mostly each and every 
and wc component we have on click on key of these things you will regularly get the things just on click of the button yeah just it's a type is equal to button okay like label it separately we need to mention okay on click immediately i'll call the change handler okay on click of this on click of this particular button immediately change handler will be triggered i am saying again on click of this particular button immediately change handler will be triggered i am defining on click of this particular button okay on click of this particular button change handler will be defined in lwc you can directly mention the function name but here you need to mention the keyword okay so i need to get some alert message on click of the message your account record your account has saved okay just i'm clicking on control s this is an event just on click of the button whenever if you click this particular button by using on click immediately uh, change handler will be triggered change handler will call this particular operation uh, then this particular alert message will be printed under the console. You can able to see it. Yes, I'm clicking this button. Everyone able to see? I got. I'll get alert, but I'm not getting alert. They're saying change handler is not defined. They're saying. Okay, I defining as like an LWC practice. In normally here, we need to define like this. I'm defining as like an LWC practice. That's why I'm getting an error on click of the button. Again, change handler is not defined on HTML button click. Yes, everyone able to see I got some alert message. Your account had saved successfully. Oh, so yes. can we see the code once? Yeah, that's it. Just let me try to mention remove also. I'm creating another button as like a remove me. Okay, just I'm calling the remote handler function. Console.log of Okay, I'm saving control S. Again, I'm saving control S. Okay, now if you click down the remove button, immediately this remove handler will be called. Then console message will be printed because I did not mention any alert message. In how many times? How many? That many times. If you click it 10 times, means 10 times that console.log will be printed. This is the thing. Anyone have any queries on this? Like every component will get. I'm saying again, in every LWC component, we'll get this. Yeah. Anyone have any queries? Change handler and remove handler are the predefined methods. Not predefined. It's your. You can mention your name also. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's a function name. That's it. As like okay, a method sir. name, whatever it may be. I mentioned previously. Yeah. Prakash, any queries for understanding? No, nothing at Prakash. the moment. Nothing. Nothing at. Are you able to understand the concept? Yeah, I'm able to follow. 
what about other people vishal yes sir everyone yes sir okay fine okay just i am explaining okay these are all the different things and let me try to explain one more it's not important just i am conveying let's see okay which is arrow functions normally uh, just to reduce the code we will use arrow function but if you want to add some just imagine 99 percentage will write to the normal code only because it's easy you can able to do it Okay, you can able to just I uh, can follow console just I'm passing the data some one of 10 comma 20 this is an easy one easy one but if you want to reduce the code yes it is possible to reduce the work code but it's somewhat tricky and difficult I can feel I can feel but it's not important just only will follow the first thing only if you want to add also the main thing we can write the same code in multiple ways. This is one of the way. Let's see. Same output, just I changed the code structure. Let's see. What I changed, I changed the code structure. Here I pass it the parameters. I used this arrow function and I'm printing here just normally the code declaration. That's it. Yeah. The same code you can write in multiple ways. Here is one of the way. That's it. Everyone able to see the output? Yeah. Any yes, changes sir. or uh, any difference in the output or same output? Same output, sir. Same output. Yeah. Just to code reducing. Even you can use same code also no worries without reducing. You need functionality. That's it. Uh, Maybe Priyanka can write different code. Yeah, Prakash uh, can write different thing. It's your wish. Arrow is playing a major role in this one, sir. Exactly. In JavaScript. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, this is about uh, some information like uh, on Java, HTML, CSS, and uh, JavaScript from the past classes. Uh, what I want to convey. So let me try to start with LWC. So before starting the LWC, yeah, let me try to give some information about LWC. LWC is nothing but a lightning web component. It has started their journey in in 2010. Okay, then it has been evolving. Uh, sorry, 2019. Okay, it has been evolving. Okay, in future also, definitely the LWC will be there. LWC is used to run based on the LWC is used to run based on the JavaScript standardized versions. Yeah, this is the thing. Okay, let us create first LWC component. Previously, I shown installation, but some of the people are highly faced the difficulty. Some of the people, but some people install successfully. But no worries. First, let me try to create one LWC component. First, LWC component and deploy it. Then I'll ask everyone to share the screen. Be ready with your screens if you are facing any difficulties. Everyone is clear. Again, I'll not ask to share the screen. After one week, if you came to me and I'm facing difficulties, it's I'm requesting everyone to complete the installation by today or tomorrow. Yeah. If your computer is not supporting in Visual Studio Code, try to do everything with Lightning Studio. Yeah. I need code. So where you develop it, it's not matters. Yes. Everyone is clear with my point? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. So previously I created LWC component folder one. So it may take some time to connect LWC these particular things. So let us create LWC component one here and let's proceed further. Yeah. Let's wait for two to three minutes and then it will be. And let's go one by one. Who is facing difficulties? Yeah, before that, let us see uh, application. So previously, I told in our first class. Okay, I'll create uh, the application, whatever it may be. Here, everyone know how to create an application. Here, everyone know how to create an application or not. 
yes, so when you so yes yes sir yes, i hope here everyone know how to create an application yeah okay i created one application lwc components april batch everyone able to see i created this application i think everyone yes, know here sandeep yes sir uh, savita vishal vishal okay i think you are new to this no worries i'll teach it first you need to navigate to app manager you need to click on new lightning app okay just you need to mention the batch name whatever it may be normally just you can upload the local local not matters click on next click on next click on next so here you can place objects like account just to search it contact click on next here you can place system administrator and click on save and finish it's completed if you click on save and finish means application will be created i am saying again but i am not clicking save and finish because i created previously okay my application what i created lwc components april batch everyone april. able to see my application vishal savita yes sir yeah so from now yes, on we'll yes, move with the new one right sir yes we are like we are uh, for each and every topic let's create one tab okay okay now let's create one tab for lightning app builder how i can create how i can create search for lightning app builder search for lightning app builder okay click on lightning app builder okay click on new everyone able to see this uh, click on new for each and every module i'm creating a separate tab let's deploy one lwc component then i'll go with uh, your doubts click on next okay today is a 21 no every but tab name let's add 21 at the end just i'm selecting three regions click on done i'm placing this tab in my application what is my application name click on save click on activate what's my application name LWC component LWC April components batch. April batch. LWC component April batch. So the information is loading. Okay, click on add page, click on save. Okay, click on save again. Now come to back side. Refresh your screen. If updated things are not came, no worries. No worries. Just you need to click on this pencil icon. Click on add more items. Click on all. Search for LWC Basics 21. Click on add one new item click on save yes everyone able to see this tab name everyone able to see yes so yes sir. and i shown previously also the first day like related lightning studio yeah just you need to install the extensions so this thing yeah so so here whenever by default you created uh, so it should be html javascript and xml and uh, no need to create any xml things xml is a common every everything it is common just you need to copy paste html javascript you need to design if you need css means you need to enable include css file in lightning studio but in normal uh, this uh, visual studio code visual studio code uh, like you need to create the file if you need means yeah 
let us create our first component here everyone able to see the create new component option create new component yes sir yes sir okay just lwc april component one let me try to mention lwc april before each and every component because i had so many components it may create naming complexions okay if you want to place in record page app page home page tab no need to create xml if you enable these check boxes okay like if you want to place this lwc component in experience cloud also okay you need to enable all these check boxes okay let me try to click on deploy so when you click on deploy immediately the form will be created so if you want to zoom in you can easily do it everyone able to see so automatically i enable the checkbox css that's why this css file is also created javascript everyone able to see the javascript and this is html yes sir yeah let me try to mention h1 i am learning lwc if you want to deploy control s in the keyboard yes it's deployed successfully everyone able to see it's deployed successfully so and you can able to see the xml yes everyone able to see automatically i am in in uh, this uh, visual studio code you need to write all this if you mention is exposed to true then only this lwc component whatever you created it will be visible to visual studio code yeah okay let me try to click on edit page i want to place the lwc component what's my lwc component name priyanka uh, lwc L -W lwc basis 21 yeah yes you can able to see just drag and drop this lwc component i'm clicking on save is it looks good is this lwc component looks good mm -hmm. is this lwc so. component okay no just only so, content that's it yeah i have a query sir yes please uh, uh, we are just creating the tab and uh, we are just uh, writing writing the code in uh, the app and then we are just dragging and dropping that is the thing yes exactly okay so yes, in exactly. lightning one uh, only template uh, html code we will write other two we need not write no 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 javascript and html we need to write xml automatically it will become in lightning studio what about css sir css we need to write okay yeah so you yes, can sir. able to observe okay uh, you can able to observe this yeah just i'm taking the snipping tool so one thing so this is also hdfc bank is also designed using uh, the sales force you can able to observe uh, these are the so you can able to so this is one card this is and like it is used to partition the information into cards okay so lightning inside the card they applied all the information you can see any lwc component you can see any lwc component it will be presented inside the lightning cards only yeah inside the lightning card see If you partition anything, it should be in cards. You can it's a search. Okay, if you mention state and if you mention city, if you mention locality, if you provided each and every information, then locality, radium, ATM, each and every details it will be it is in lightning card. Okay, inside the card, it should be represented. Even we need to every time we need to go inside the lightning card. These are the common thing. Lightning card. Some people after uh, because I see in my experience I had deal with multiple batches. Really, I don't know why the people after 20 days they will say that why we are using lightning card. They will ask me the question. I am requesting uh, like please practice after completion of the class. Then only the people will get a good jobs and good career. Yeah, at least basic things you can. The next two weeks if you practice it means after that uh, if you have work also then after the class you can practice no worries the next two, two weeks are very essential everyone is clear with my point next to two, two weeks yes sir yeah just i'm deploying this component i'm refreshing my screen 
everyone able to say i place the information uh, the back and there is a white and every time we can use the same structure in the lightning card only we can everyone able to see yes so previously yeah. it is just the text yes yes every time we need to place inside the lightning card only yeah so we have lightning design system to apply some paddings and we have lightning studio everything we have not lightning studio it's a lwc component library okay we can use this both for creating whenever if you got syntax issues or whatever it is but try to write from your own starting later on in future you can do it okay just i want to place the info uh, so here, here you can able to see it you can able to see the data the content is placed on the last you can able to see the data is not placed in the middle everyone able to observe this yes everyone sir. able to observe this yeah if you want to place every time we can use the same inside this only we'll write the logic div class is equal to just every time same thing where p around the medium means we are placing the data in the center somewhat the data will be moved every time same no change because this is our first class maybe you can face difficulties but every time same i'm deploying control as i deployed it successfully i'm refreshing my screen yes everyone able to see the difference as compared to previous and now everyone able to see the difference priyanka any yes, difference yes. you found it what's the difference you found it not only priyanka sandeep what's the difference you found it previously uh, left side of i am learning lwc there is uh, some space is not there now space is available that is yes, a thing sir. yeah every time we need to place the uh, yeah, content in between div class is equal to sls where p around medium only in the in that we need to write all the content yeah. anyone have any queries still now whatever i discussed any queries any queries to anyone uh, that whatever i discussed so it's mandatory to use this uh, yes, uh, box is exactly. the white one if you use it then it, the content looks fine otherwise it should not look looks good yes sir. so can we see that code for this particular basic there is nothing to do with uh, javascript and uh, css yeah. right yeah yeah yes i'll go further i'll go further just uh, it's a lwc component how to derive how to deploy that's it i showed okay so and uh, one more thing sir you want us to develop a new application to execute yeah, yeah. this yes yes exactly okay so we have to leave the previous one yeah because i feel and okay. this is separate folder i'm thinking i mean or you want us to add the tabs to the no don't application. do that no 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 you see you separate one because okay. i'm thinking to do like this and you can ask me how i need to create lwc component here okay control shift b in the keyboard okay s of dx if you are unable to find create lightning web component okay and lwc just i am mentioning lwc april component to deploy you can able to see when i am creating lightning web component it may take some time i think there it's very very easy to create an lwc component only for your understanding i'm giving here also it may take some time to create yeah everyone able to see uh, html only javascript xml is there everyone able to see xml also we need to define yeah we need to copy the code xml is a common for every code okay you need to do it yeah xml is common okay just i'm mentioning lightning code 
okay if you want to deploy their control as it's easy here left click this okay deploy source to org click this deploy source to org yeah everyone able to see it's deployed deployed okay just you need to click on edit page which one is easy which one is easy i feel lightning studio is easy yeah. lightning studio yes component name lwc april component So LWC April component one. Yeah, it is component two, not component one. Okay, I did not mention any content. That's why that only created this. Yeah, this is about just I created first LWC component. It did not done anything. Okay, just only for your understanding. Now let's go step by step on your installation process. Everyone understood still whatever I discussed. Everyone understood still whatever I discussed. Yeah, we need to review for some hmm? video. Yeah, we yes, understood. Sir. We need to review the video again. Yeah, yes, yes, please. Yeah, it will be uploaded in the drive. Yeah. So if anyone not registered means uh, you can ask your team to register the training. Tomorrow onwards link will be changed. We will send an email. Okay, now let's start with everyone. First, let's go with Prakash. Prakash, what's the installation issue you are facing? Savita. Savita. Let me share my screen. Uh, yes. Will I and please share entire screen don't share one screen okay prakash sure sure let me know once you can view the screen yes i can able to see the screen it's here after yeah click on control shift p one minute control shift p uh, click that, that create uh, click that, click that. standard yeah. uh, you created the component uh, folder one show the yes. folder once uh, drag the folder left side you have uh, yeah then why you're not getting uh, after this uh, there's a specific... you okay please follow the steps I mentioned control shift P please do it in front of me I think you did so not that's, that's, com step. that's completed uh Venkat. Uh, control if you completed means if you completed means uh you can you'll get the file prakash you did not got file if you did not got file means you did not completed the process okay you control got my point. I, I did that uh, click create project with manifest okay yeah click on standard and this yes i did that now one minute now create one folder mention lwc uh, component folder one Okay, means in that uh, we are we are creating some subfolder. Okay. Hmm. Okay, enter. Not a component dimension folder. Click on create project. Create project. Create. You done this step previously? No, not I didn't. Yes, this I, is the main. Yeah. Okay, wait for some time based on your internet connection, it will be connected. Then you'll get no default or then please do the same process uh, whatever we have available in the docs okay. so don't do that click on wrong icon click on wrong icon okay so we have no default org set you can able to see the screen under down under down no default yes, org set. Yes. Yeah. click this click this prakash it may take some time prakash to activate the extension then i told you the previous process now otherwise an org okay then you need to connect your org okay okay one yeah yes please do it Rakesh in between yeah you got it it's good click on authorize an org click on authorize an org upper 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 prakash no 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 yes, yes. Uh, top, got it, got top. It. Uh, yeah, yeah, got it. yeah 
वन मिनट इट विल बी यस क्लिक ऑन प्रोजेक्ट डिफॉल्ट प्रकाश क्लिक ऑन एंटर इन द कीबोर्ड इट इज शोइंग एस एफ बी एक्स ऑथराइज एन और कैंसिल ना वन गो टू एक्सटेंशन प्रकाश लेफ्ट साइड टैब एक्सटेंशन क्लिक सर्च फॉर एक्सटेंशन पैक प्रकाश सेल्स फॉर एक्सटेंशन सर्च फॉर एक्सटेंशन प्रकाश नो वरी Install this one, Prakash. If anyone facing the similar issue, install this one, everyone. Which one you want, Kat? I copied in the chart. Once copy the same. So when could both we need to install like uh, Salesforce extension pack and Salesforce extension pack expanded? Yeah. Both. Okay. Yeah, Prakash, you need to install in Visual Studio Code. Yeah. yeah. Yes, install both. Yeah, if you are facing difficulty, if you are difficult, other reason or cancel, install both. Okay. Yeah. Then you can proceed further, Prakash. You will not face any issues in between. You can proceed. I will ask other people to share their screens. Okay. Sure, sure, Vankaj. So okay, the pro, the, the other, the next steps would be same as it is for the previous one, right? As mentioned in yes. the Word document. Yes. Authorize an org. Okay. Then you need to click on Enter. Okay. Then if you click on Enter, it will be connected to Google Chrome. Yeah. It done. Control Shift. I think you are. Yeah. No default org. Click on No default org. Yeah. Huh? Not. Not that Prakash. No default org. No default. Edit method. Yeah. Yes, other is another. Click on other is another. First option. Again, first option. Enter. Enter, right? Ah. Uh, yeah, we'll get to some people this issue. I think Savita faced this issue. Have you resolved Savita? Savita, have you resolved this issue? I also faced the similar issue. What I done is I closed the folder, okay, and again I created a new folder in the dot vs code. I done the, I loaded that and I done. Now and then I got, I did not got the issue. Okay, please do the same process, uh, Prakash. Okay. Because I got uh, where you created the folder once. Please show it. Navigated to File Explorer. Where you created the folder? Okay. Navigate to back. Create a new folder again once. Please try it, Prakash. Okay. Sure. And uh, otherwise, if you are unable to get the issue, okay, go with the Lightning Studio. Okay, Lightning Studio. Okay. Yeah. And and share your screen, Prakash. In between, please try it. Yes. Sure, sure. Let's go to Savita. 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 Vankat, can you please check my? Uh... What is the issue you are facing, Nagraj? Um, uh, sales or sections and um, I thought uh, I will hmm? share my screen. Hmm. Yeah, I am giving access. You install everything? Yes, yes. Okay, let's see. Please share your screen. Can you able to see my screen? Yeah. Yes. First of all, navigate to under top. Top we have folder, no? Once navigate to there. Top, top. Top. No, no, no. So you came to right direction only. You came to just there is some first icon is there, no? Click on that particular first icon, notebook. That. Explorer. Click, click that. Click that explorer, Nagraj. Okay. Click your. Okay. 
you first create a folder and open it here you done all the process or not uh, this one i have not without doing all this how you can from here where uh... one minute first you install self cli or not yeah install okay extension pack you install or not extension i have doubt uh... once go to visual studio code please install and then you can share the screen if you are facing issues yeah what's the issue yeah, you faced nagraj from here uh, no idea Go copy the same copy the same what i mentioned in the chart in the chart i mentioned in the go to meeting chart copy the same and place here Meeting chat. Okay, go. Nagraj, and copy the yeah. things and do the same process. Whatever I discussed in the first class, second class, in Friday class. Okay. Yeah. And the ones, please follow the document. After following the document, if you are facing the issue, means then you can revert me. Okay. Okay. Because you need to complete the process. Then once uh, see the once copy it. No, I am not able to see this. Okay. Then how we can proceed? If you copy it, it means you can paste it there. Means then we can. Yeah, I have pasted here. I pasted Salesforce extension pack expanded, not uh, Salesforce extension pack. So oh, everything. one minute i want to convey so where you are searching the data you need to search the data under down not here down here we get yeah anyone please guide 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 nagraj i think everyone understood the installation priyanka once please guide yeah uh, so from uh, no default org yeah not here uh, first uh, under search this... box under top top yeah 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 here huh? Yeah, file you no know but just beneath it just down to that no no, no down to that okay. you can see the search uh, box yeah, over yeah. there right yeah yeah here only again come to down again come to down this one um, again come to down last one down 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 the last one yeah boxes now yes. search now search now just copy and paste it whichever you have done it install yeah install click on install you got it you got it on the number 14 install it it is installing okay then do the same process nagraj what are i discussed go to c users dot vs code create a one folder then load that folder and do the same process okay okay go to windows c yeah go to file explorer nagraj Yeah. Go to C drive. Yeah, I users. am in C drive only. Yeah. Users. Users. Uh, public or your name? Your name, sorry. Dot uh, vs code. Dot vs code. Okay, create a new folder. Left click and create a new folder. now load this data yeah now load this folder click on file click on open click on file and click on open 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 file. folder open folder load that folder Okay. Do the same process, Nagraj. Okay. Okay. Do the same process. Hello, hello. Trust and hello. Okay. Do the same process, Nagraj.
Okay, same yeah. process for all. Yes, yes, exactly. Okay, I think uh, stop share your screen, Nagraj. Okay, I think uh, follow the document and do the same process. Okay, okay. Nagraj, you. clear. Thank you. Santosh, what about Santosh? Santosh. Oh, so I'm following same uh, where Prakash was, stuck, so I'm following that one. Uh, the thing is, the first uh, issue is what you need to do, Santosh. Uh, uh -huh. You need to uh, first close the folder. Okay, and create a new yes. folder and try it. Okay, if you yeah, done yeah, answers yeah. again, same issue. Okay, what you need to do is uh, again just uninstall all the things and do okay. it from scratch. As sales was here and uh, extension pack each and everything install again. Okay, okay, okay. and uh, do the process. This is the thing. Restart your system and do it. This is the thing. And if you are unable to face this issue, don't struck on that. Uh, we have Lightning Studio. Go with that Lightning Studio. Okay. Okay, sir. Yeah, sure. We'll do that. Okay. Uh, sir, I wanted to share my screen, sir. So. Yeah, one minute, one minute, one minute. Spandana, Divya, Snehashmita, you are facing any issues? Uh, Venkat, I am not able to connect LWC with Visual Studio Code, actually. At the last step in the documents no you gave last... No default or good. Uh, that's a... Yeah. Connected... Like, uh, uh, I'll double okay, what uh, your, once please share yeah, your screen yeah, yeah if you connected with laptop yeah i'm going yes, one by one priyanka I'm not getting share option. Why? I give an access. Okay. Okay, I'm not getting share option. Uh, my doubt is uh, like uh, in the last step, uh, uh, you mentioned like SFDX. Uh, Create lightning web component. There I'm, I got stuck. Okay. When you're creating lightning, you connected with Arc also means. I didn't connect Arc. I'm able okay. to connect with Salesforce. Mm, yeah, you not. connected with. Yeah, you connected with Salesforce. Yeah, yeah. Okay, but then it's fine. But not with LWC. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. LWC will create a components. Control Shift to be search for. SFDX create lightning web component in the search That's box. not I. Uh, uh, that is not uh, I'm getting. Okay. Once uh, share your screen, that I can able to identify the exact uh, cause for that. Yeah. Are you able to see now? Please share entire screens for that. I shared the specific screen. No. Uh, the same thing. No change. Okay. Then we can uh, once please message me, Spandra, your query. Okay. 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 Uh, Divya, are you facing any issues? Oh yes, sir. But at this moment, I'm outside, so I can't connect with the screen. Once I'll please share you. the screen. Once please send the screenshot. Okay. Yes, yeah. sir. Sure. Yeah. Snehashmita, you are facing any issues? I know when but I'm fine. Priyanka, you are facing any issues? I'm giving you access. Please share your screen. Yeah, I give you access once. Please share your screen, Priyanka. So, is it visible, sir? Yeah, it is visible. Open the Visual Studio Code. Yes, sir. So my thing is I have done everything. So I have installed everything, Salesforce CLI, extension. I have done everything. OK. So now I have created LWC project uh, folder also, subfolder. Please open it. Open the folder. Okay. Subfolder everything. 
click on no, don't do that one minute go to yeah. visual studio code yes sir. okay so there we have recent there we have recent now click on the tell wc project this one yeah. uh, click yeah. that yeah this yeah, is the one yeah everything uh, is fine sir up till here so how can uh, i go to uh, salesforce uh, login from this one because pro okay. sub, sub folder is also done right okay uh, so we have no default org now you need to click on no default org you did not got no default org you need a, a good internet connection or otherwise you need to wait for 30 minutes or one hour like that yeah you I need know, to get no uh, default org. Sir, I'm getting that option when I only click on Control Shift P. No, But no, no, it will get. To... No, 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 it will get. Wait for some time. Wait for some time for half an okay, hour. Okay, yeah, got it, sir. Got it. Click that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this completely depends upon. Yeah. Wait. Okay. Don't click anything. Click on no default org. Okay, click on no default or can proceed further process same Priyanka. Okay. Directly will it get logged into this? Yeah, it may take some time, Priyanka. Click on that and click on uh, that uh, address and org and the project default enter and immediately it will be logged into your Salesforce and it will be proceeded further. Okay. Okay. Okay, sir. Do that. Okay. I hope it's fine. Stop share your screen. Venkat, I came till the uh, Salesforce login app. It it popped up. Do you want me okay. to share my screen? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Please share your screen. I think let me try to check it. What's the issue? How you resolve the issue? I, as you said, I made uh, I re uh, closed this app uh, and uh, started uh, refreshed the system and just reopened it. Yes. Visual Studio. Yes, yes, yes. Please do the same. Do it. Same process. Yes, I give an access. Please share. Everyone, please yeah. do the same. Here I am. I got it. Okay. If you can see my screen. And then. Okay. Go to Visual Studio Code. Not here. Okay. I'm at Visual Studio Code. Ah, uh, yeah. Now where the uh, screen has been given login screen. Please open that login screen. Login screen. Salesforce login screen. To your Google Chrome, it will turn. Open Google Chrome. Not that, not. So it it came Call here. It. it popped up here. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Enter your credentials. Enter your credentials. The same, the same old ones, right? Yeah. Do login. Yes, same old details. Click on login. Sure. Okay, you need to give the specified username and enter. Then you need to allow the access. Then only it will be proceeded. All right. Uh, sir, I tried now. It is showing the same pop up which is showing for others. With yeah, then you, uh, one, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Prakash, what's the how you resolve the issue? Once, please tell to Priyanka also. I closed the Visual uh, Studio. I refreshed uh, my. Uh, I clicked on F5 button multiple times, refreshed it, and reopened it and began to do it again. So you didn't create the folder again. I did. I I did the clear for. I I created the folder before itself, uh, mentioning okay. it as LMC, L, LWC components one. If you can see it. I I closed this one. I closed Visual Studio completely, okay. refreshed it uh, multiple times, and reopened it. And then uh, okay. begin to follow the steps by clicking on No Default Offset. Yeah. Then uh, the, these steps, as it as it, as it is mentioned here, it popped up. Yeah. I just followed these ones. 
SFTC authorized on Anog, and then came mm -hmm. the project default. Uh, then I clicked on enter. I uh, connected. Uh, there is fine for me also, but the only thing is when I press on enter, no, it's uh, uh, coming with a red pop up SFTC and org failed to run. I can come up till the last step, but the last step it's showing the uh, into mark. So there I'm getting stuck. Uh, did you click on no default docs it uh, yes yes all that is done at last we'll press the enter right so up till there i'm yeah. able to come yeah yeah yes priyanka he's saying that first you need to close the visual studio code you can refresh your screen and open the new folder again and then please try it once again okay then you can resolve the issue <laughs> but like that every time we cannot create a new folder no sir I'm saying that uh, just uh, sometimes we'll face this type of issues, Priyanka. We'll do with Lightning Studio only. Okay, if you post okay. that type of issues, then you can do like this. Okay, like uh, okay. every time we'll not create the folder, Priyanka. In one folder, we'll create a multiple LWC components. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, I think you can reset your password and username. Please be aware. Yeah, I will do that. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. Okay, stop share your screen, Prakash. And do the sure. same thing, Priyanka, and everyone also. Close the Visual Studio code and close the folder and open the new folder and try it again. Then you can uh, resolve the issue. Okay. Otherwise, uninstall it and install it again. Okay. Okay, team, thank you. This is about today's class. Don't uh, just move further. Use Lightning Studio. If you're facing the issue, don't sit on the LWC. No worries. Go with Lightning Studio and proceed. Okay. Yeah, okay, team. Thank you. Please uh, go with Lightning Studio and uh, update me the first LWC component of the screenshot of everyone before tomorrow class. Okay. This is about today's class team. Thank you, everyone. Okay. Let's see tomorrow. Okay. Bye, everyone. Let's meet tomorrow. Thank you. Bye.